Champagne season is here and it's easy to tell. Billboards like that one calling out State Senator Tom Barrett's voting record went up earlier this week. The ads are an early indication of one hot topic for mid-Michigan voters. The billboards located in downtown Lansing and in Potterville call out Barrett for voting against the incentive package that enticed General Motors to build their new electric vehicle battery plant in Lansing. What they are doing is, um, you know, like they always do, they're sensationalizing or exaggerating part of my voting record. And what they are pointing out in that ad or in that billboard that they have up uh, is that I voted against um, on deep principle of mine voted against a direct supplemental fund of money to go directly to one beneficiary. Barrett, who is running against Congresswoman Alyssa Slotkin in the newly redrawn 7th House District, tells me he would rather see that sort of money go towards infrastructure, talent and development, and the cost of energy in the state, even though the move was widely celebrated by union workers in the area. We know the auto industry is a major component of our uh, economic uh, growth here and stability in Michigan and, and having a, another uh, massive investment like uh, like what GM recently did, $7 billion, uh, is only a good thing. So I'm not sure what he's thinking, but that's something for him to answer. The billboards are not endorsed or paid for by Slotkin. The money comes from the Democratic Congressional Campaign Committee. A committee spokesperson tells me the billboards will be up for the next couple of weeks and are meant to hold Barrett accountable to his voting record. I take a very principled position on the votes that I cast. I said that I was opposed to these types of direct corporate welfare incentives and I've held true to that. I have voted against over 99% of corporate welfare uh, that's come through the legislature in the time that I've been elected. Slotkin declined to comment on the billboards. For now, reporting in Lansing, I'm your Capitol reporter, Elle Myers, Fox 47 News.